right, guys, we're getting ready to go on a test drive in a 1968 convertible Tempest. If you haven't already, check out my walk around videos. I walk around, point out any kind of flaws, but right now we're gonna take her down the road. Getting ready to take off. I just got done with a walk around video. Like I said, you can check that out. Uh, point out any kind of things that I see around the outside that are wrong. We're going to take a little lunch break. I got my buddy Bernie in the back. Park floods out a little bit, so you got to give it a little gas before you start it. Uh, while we're driving down the road, it's not going to flood out or anything. Don't worry about that. It's just initially, as soon as you cut it off, you got to try to cut it back on 10 minutes later. Uh, the car's showing 54,000 miles. I can't stand behind that just because people can change out the dashes. But I want to tell you what it shows. So It's got a Hurst shifter in it. It's a Pontiac 478 through, uh, or 68 through 69, which very well could be the original motor, but I don't have the TVHS documents to prove that. It looks like our RPM gauge up there, the needle's lost. It looks like it's all the way down. It's not moving. It should be coming up. It's probably just not hooked up. Uh, our gas gauge is floating around, so it looks like it's working. Our horn's not working. Our wipers do work, though. A little, a little hot up in here. We'll crack our vent window. Let's see. I'll try to find the seatbelt real quick. Got an open road. Nobody's around, so. funny the whole time I was going around that back road 
It said we were doing 70 and a cop was following us the whole time. <laughs> I, I think he'd have got us if we were doing 70. There's no overdrive gear in this car. It's just one, two, three. Uh, it's definitely not set up for the highway. You wouldn't want to be trying to do 70. Say probably about 60 max, 65. But you don't want the R's over 3,500 for a long period of time. You just kind of want to cruise these cars with the low end gears like that. If you went and got that changed out, which isn't too hard to do, you could probably cruise 75, 80. But definitely keep that in mind. This car is definitely not a highway car, at least right now. our test drive video we're gonna take off do a little back road cruising here if y'all haven't already please check out that walk around video or jump on my website maplemotors.com got a hundred detailed pictures on there of underneath this car inside and out plus a full list of our inventory and we update that once a week Check that out. If you like that page, give us a call. 615-822-4444. We'll be here to help you out and answer any of your questions. Appreciate y'all watching. Look, cat's crossing the road. He's like, uh-oh. Or this beast coming. <laughs> it's a white cat. Is that good luck? A white cat's crossing the room? I think so. I think so. That black cat means it's bad. You're supposed to turn around. I'll press my luck too. <laughs> I post stuff like this every single day and uh, we're gonna eat and I'm gonna get back at it. Thanks again guys Before I end this video, I'm gonna go ahead and drop the top for you uh, it's Super easy you pull this lever over here same on this side here Pull your visors down so you can see what's going on make sure you're loose but You don't want to do it and then uh, the switch is literally right here on the dash that's down and this is up A little crinkly Top goes down nice and fast. Same thing, we're gonna go ahead and leave it down because we're gonna go in and eat. And uh, then we'll head back to the lot.